This is how you assign letter grades in Excel. We're going to use a function called XLOOKUP. And the first argument in there will be the lookup value itself, which is going to be our mark in cell C5. And then the second argument is your lookup array. Since this is mark and this is our guide post table, we're going to highlight the mark guide column like this and press F4 once to make both row and column fix. The third argument is your return array, which is going to return the grade itself. We're going to highlight the grade column like this, press F4 once to make both row and column fix. And then the third argument is what do you want to show if the if the particular grade is not found. Maybe I'll just say uh, grade not found like that. And then the final argument in there, we want it to be exact match or next smaller item. Let's say we select Elizabeth who got a mark of 71. Her grade would be C minus. That's because her mark is less than 73 for grade C. But since it is greater than 70, therefore her grade is C minus. So we're going to select that one there. You can choose a larger if you like, which means the next number after that. So this will allow you to say greater than or less than or equal to. So I'm going to choose uh, negative one for our case, close parenthesis and hit enter and then apply the same formula for the rest of the row like this. As you can see, 97 is right here. So that's why it's returning A plus. And since 96 is larger than uh, 93, but lesser than 97, it's returning a value of A.